inflation has over has hit all over the world and even in Tanzania have hit us a lot badly. Communities were rising up and we are in a bit worried that our budget for this year will be highly, highly difficult to explain. For example, this is one kilogram of sugar. Last year we bought it about uh, 2,500. But this year in Ramadan, we will buy it on around uh, 3,000. It's uh, approximately 20% increase in price. And not only this one, but also will be in demand in uh, cooking oils, rice and beans. That's very, very difficult because may rise up to the 1,000 per age. COVID ilivyo ingia na mashirika mengi yalifungwa watu wengi walikosa kazi kwa hiyo katika ndugu zetu pia wamekosa kazi kwa hiyo the end of the day wanakuja kuwa dependents wanatutegemea sisi ambao tupo makazini kwa hiyo hiyo pia ime imeikuwa ime ni challenge kubwa kwa sababu wanahitaji sisi tuwasaidie wao as you know Tanzania we import many products than the, the products we export so it affect us a lot. There are some necessary products which we are not available during uh, the start of, of COVID-19 until this year. WFAID ni important sana kwetu kama taasisi sisi Bilali tuna vituo nje ya Dar es Salaam mikoani vijijini na as you know watu wa vijijini ni wako very poor sawa so, wanakuwa na uhitaji wa vitu kama hivyo kwa kama mtu anafunga katika mwezi wa Ramadhani na anajua futari ipo WF anatoa anakuwa anafunga kwa amani na anaifurahia funga yake tofauti na vile mtu anafunga hajui cha kufuturu ni nini Kwa hiyo kwa WFAD kutaka kufanya viftari, eni ni muhimu sana, eni na inasaidia sana. As one of beneficiaries of WFAD, uh, it helps us a lot because they provide full parcel and that is enough food for a family for all the, the days of, of Ramadan. We have a lot of challenges this year. Because of the scarcity of the communities, a lot of people have lost their jobs and their dependents in our institutions. So we are a bit worried that we cannot even cover all the families that are in demand. This is extremely challenging to our Bilal Muslim Mission of Tanzania team.